Hello, this is Guy Laboon from Yowie News, here reporting live from the premiere of the new Dengus 007 movie, Thunder Dengus. As you can see, I'm uh, just outside the cinema here, and it's about to screen for the galactic premiere. It's an absolute who's who of the galaxy's brightest stars. Anyone who is anyone is here right now. I saw the burrs go in just before we went live. And look at that! Just over there, we have Obsidian Ant! Yes, it looks like he's already a few nectar drops in. And is that... is that Yannix? No, no, that's just a part of it. Um, and what's that smell? Oh my, that is definitely a giraffe carcass. I heard they'll be doing a seance just before the screening so Mars and Sparks can channel in and see the movie. I'm pretty sure the Starstone siblings are inside already as well. Woody and Starstone probably has a secret escape tunnel into the cinema. Oh, and what's this? You want me to read this? Okay. Uh, would the commander with the license plate Muppet for Life please move your Type 9? It is blocking the mail slot. I think that's a Scorpius. And is that Orange Phoenix over there? Yep, yep, it is. And someone's already called the fire department. And look! A Stargoid showed up! Normally that would be a great concern, but for this premiere, a rare temporary ceasefire with the Great Green Foe has been called. Everyone is here to enjoy the movie film. And we have some of the stars of the film arriving shortly. Oh, speak of the devil, here's one now. Hello, who are you, balding man? Yeah, um, I'm an actor named uh, Jeffrey Spooneman, and I play the villain in this movie. His name is number two. Like poo poo. Yeah, that joke is made in the film. A couple times. Too many times, in my opinion, but the director did want to hear my opinion. It could have been a really classy flick, but there's a lot of lowbrow humor, you know? We love our lowbrow humor here at Galley News. Even just saying poo-poo is hilarious, it makes me giggle. Okay, pal. What was it like working with the great Spatula 007? Um, no comment. That bad, eh? Come on, just give us one little anecdote. My mother always said, if you don't got nothing nice to say, express yourself physically instead. So you ask me that question again, I'll knock your head off. Okay, thank you, Jeffrey. Enjoy the premiere. Oh, look, it's another guest. The Bond girl herself, actress Jenna Tater. Oh, hi, guy. Nice to see you, as usual. Jenna, you are looking fabulous, girl. What are you wearing tonight? Oh, uh, that's a custom Remlock Artemis suit with enhanced life support, jump assist, and night vision. Ooh, girl, so you can see in the dark. I just want to take you home and have you use that night vision to check for monsters under my bed. I, I wouldn't do that. Why, are you afraid of monsters? No, you, you know what I'm talking about, Jeffrey. I'm fine talking to you in a professional capacity, but you're not allowed within 500 meters of my house again, or you will go to jail. You understand that, right? Okay, yes, absolutely, Jenna. Thanks for stopping by. Hey, um, do you know when our special 007, the big star of the night, is going to arrive? Fuck off, Jeffrey. Wonderful! Well, it looks like we have another star arriving. Um, who is this? Hey, uh, I'm Tim Frupe. Uh, I did the sound mixing. Uh... You're blocking my shot. Please. Oh. Ah, there we go. It's the man who plays Agent O, who gives Spatula all his cool gadgets in the movie. Do we love gadgets here at Galley News? Yes, we do. What gadgets will be in this one, O? I don't know. What do you mean? Well... I show up, stand in front of a green screen, naked. They green screen my clothes on, it's humiliating. I don't know why they do that. I don't know who they even are. The lights are too bright for me to see the faces. They make me say my lines and then they ask me to leave. Why does it have to be naked? They say I'm lucky to even come to this premiere since I'm not really a name. Okay then, um, well do you, do you know when Spatula 007 will be here? I don't even know who I am anymore. Okay, thank you. Well, it looks like the movie's just about ready to start. Uh, Spatula was supposed to be here, but I don't see him. Oh, I'm, I'm getting a message from my producer. Oh, we have Takoso inside. Can, can you connect me? Oh, wow. Hi, Takoso. This this is amazing. Even better than Spatula, to be honest. You're the real star of these Bond movies with your killer tunes. So tell me, what do you think of the movie? What do I think of the movie? I haven't seen it. He made me write the music in a dark room at gunpoint. Okay, uh, and uh, tell us, uh, how do you get your ideas? Mainly Walmart, plus finding the head of a HIP proto squid in your bed with a note saying, I have your wife and kids, really, really helps. And, and finally, uh, Takoso, what was it like working with Spatch? It was the best experience of my life. Can I see my children now? 
Thank you, Chicoso. Well, this film is about to begin and Spatula is nowhere to be seen, so I guess we'll just have to try and find him on the way out. Uh, no big deal, really. We've got a who's who of the galaxy here in one room. Like, who even cares if Spatula shows up to his own premiere? Because in this one building, we have more talent and awesomeness than anywhere else in the galaxy. Right here, in this cinema. Oh, uh, wait, there's something on the radar. Oh, here he comes now, it's Spatula. Oh no, I can't stop. Nova, Nova. Put on the brakes, Nova. Put on the brakes, Nova. Ah! Oh my god. The humanity. The humanity. He's killed them all. The entire premiere. They're all dead. Oh, no, wait, I think someone's alive. Call Surgeon Rescue. No, no, wait, they died. Oh god. Oh god. The premiere of Thunder Dangus will take place online at Spatula 007's YouTube page. Thank you, and we apologize for this interruption.